Welcome on in guys, FM Golf here, Freddie, and we have a golf ball review for you today. We're going to be taking a look at the Tour Response Stripe. As you can see, it's the multi-colored pack. To me, it's the greatest golf ball ever made. But guys, stay tuned to the end of the video as we will be giving away a box of these golf balls, plus a couple of other things. So like I said, it's the Tour Response Stripe. You may be wondering, what's so stripey about it? Well, that's pretty obvious, and it's the fact that there's a large stripe on the golf ball in a, a different color to help you. But you get that point, right? Got it. The first thing I want to do is take you through some of the technology that's in this golf ball, um, some things that TaylorMade have said about this golf ball, and then I'm going to tell you if that indeed is true or if it's not true. Well, we all know TaylorMade as being a driver manufacturer, right? Now they do make other, other clubs, but throughout the years their driver has been their strong suit in their lineup of golf equipment. That's no questions asked. Over the years they've been the number one driver in golf. With the introduction of the TP5 and TP5X, I don't know how many years ago, it was quite a few years ago. Ever since then, TaylorMade's kind of started to become this golf ball and equipment juggernaut. Look at the stealth, even the irons, the P790s became the most popular iron in all of golf uh, for the amateurs. Whenever that came out in like 2017, it, it may have been uh, 2016, but you get my point. So now they bring us some golf balls such as the TP5, the TP5X. They were made to rival the Pro V1 and the Pro V1X. Those two golf balls, the Pro V1 and Pro V1X, are staples in the golf community. They will forever be the GOAT, quote unquote, in the golf ball game. They're legendary. They've been around forever. So once they made that direct comparison to the, the Pro V1 and the Pro V1X, then naturally it was time to make a golf ball for the masses. For someone that doesn't benefit from buying, you know, a $50 box of golf balls, that's where these come in. TaylorMade has started to change this golf ball to compete with the higher end golf balls of other manufacturers. Think of your Chrome Softs, even the Z-Star, Q-Star. That's what this is designed for. TaylorMade really has doubled down on that. Even the cover of this golf ball, it's 100% cast urethane. That's the same cover in the TP5, TP5Xs, Pro V1, all of them. They have this specific element in the cover, and that's great. They're bringing it to an affordable price, perfect. The TP5 and the TP5X, the five stands for a five layer golf ball. There's five different layers inside of the golf ball. This is a three layer construction. Um, so a little bit less layers here, uh, meant for a little bit softer feel, promote more spin. So that's kind of the reason for it to be three layers instead of five that you see in the TP5 and the TP5X. And another thing that they brought to this golf ball that was not in this golf ball previously is the dimple pattern that's used on the TP5 and the TP5X. So again, you have the cast urethane cover and the dimple pattern that's both being brought to this budget-friendly golf ball for the average consumer that's used in their pro models. That's kind of great. So now we get to the fun part, and, and that's the stripe line that's around the golf ball. If you look at the ball, there's a blue line. Right? What is that blue line for? TaylorMade has defined this as a 360 clear path alignment. This makes it different than any other golf ball that has a line feature. You think of your Callaway uh, triple track, right? TaylorMade also has the TP5 Picks that has this different like logo design by Ricky Fowler all over it. And it kind of has a line going down the center, but there's a lot going on in that ball. It's hard to actually tell um, where that line is. So they made it the entire golf ball in a different color. I love this design personally. I think it allows you to line up the golf ball for a putt a whole lot easier. Brilliant concept. Now TaylorMade has determined that this golf ball specifically is for players with fast swing speeds. If you swing relatively fast, you're going to love this golf ball. And the reason you're going to love this golf ball is because it's soft. That urethane cover that's in the TP5 and TP5X. And because it's softer, you're going to get a much higher ball flight. You're going to get the high ball flight because it's softer. You get more spin as well. The reason why you hit a golf ball so high is because when you hit it and it starts that backspin, the higher the spin, the science and the physics behind it, 
it's gonna push more air under the golf ball and it's gonna launch higher. So along with the high launch, they also claim a high spin with this ball. And I can confirm that with this golf ball, I do get a lot more spin, um, not only around the greens, but also just in like full wedge shots. I have played the, the uh, Vice Pro and the Vice Pro Plus, and although they're good golf balls, I don't get the spin and the backspin with those that I get with this. And that, I think there's something to be said for that. Um, it gives you a great feel putting the golf ball. You don't get that kind of hard clicky, click, click noise that just sounds disgusting. Um, you get a nice, like, muted sound almost off the face. I believe it when people say you don't know how much you miss something until you don't have it, right? Yeah, and I know you've heard that saying. That's me with the line on this golf ball. I didn't know how much I used this line or really liked this line until it wasn't on the golf ball anymore. Another thing that you can do with this golf ball is you can actually put it on the tee and line it toward uh, the fairway and that'll help your alignment um, straight from the tee box. So you get alignment on the putting and the tee box. The biggest downfall for this golf ball to me is two things. Number one, fairway shots. Now, if this golf ball randomly falls in the ground or whatever, and it's sitting very awkwardly where the line is not facing toward the green or the hole, that can mess with you mentally, and I totally hear you and understand that. Now, I mentioned one more downfall of this golf ball, uh, and I'm going to try to put it on the screen here. Um, I just got these out of the package, and some of the blue is already starting to wear off. And I have had the yellow in here start to wear off after you've used it for a couple holes. But it, it's one of those things that you kind of know what you're getting yourself into. This golf ball is great for the average player. It's great for the very good player, um, the low handicap, the high handicap. Overall, to me, I've fallen in love with this golf ball, and I would prefer this golf ball over a TP5, TP5X, all of the Pro V1s, the Vice, the Srixons, the Callaways. This is the golf ball for me. I would head out to your local like PJ Tour Superstore because they sell these uh, individually, and so it might be worth going out there. I know that it's like 350 a, a pop, which is wow, that's really expensive, but. You could get you a couple of these, take it out to the golf course, try it before you spend, you know, I think this was $42 for the 12 pack. Overall, I think it's worth it and I would definitely give it a shot if I were you. So let's talk about this giveaway I mentioned at the beginning of this video. Uh, we are doing a giveaway at 500 subscribers. Now your way to enter into that is number one, you have to be subscribed, obviously. Number two is you have to comment on this video what your favorite color of this multi-pack is. We have red, blue, orange, and green. Those are the four. And the winner, once we get to 500 subscribers and you've done both of those things, once we announce the winner, you will be receiving your very own dozen of the Tour Response Stripe multi-pack, as well as a tailor-made hat and a tailor-made glove. Shipped right to your door from us as a thank you and a token of our appreciation for you guys watching. So guys, that's it. Thanks for watching. That has been a review of the Tour Response Stripe. My favorite golf ball. I think it's the greatest golf ball ever made due to the technology around as well as some other things inside. Thanks for watching. That has been another review and edition of FM Golf.